golf education for all the guys out there. What we're going to do today is we're going to test a few flexes in shops. So we've got five different flexes that is in there for the golf market. You get obviously your X flex, stiff flex, regular flex, seniors and ladies. So today, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna test the hazardous smoke shaft out here. Um, in an X-Flex, which is a 6.5, the stiff flex, which is a 6.0, and then the regular flex shaft, the 5.5. And we'll show you the difference of what a flex can do in the golf swing. Alright, so for today's testing, I'm going to use the Strixon ZX7 driver. If I look at this shaft, which is the hazardous smoke 6.5, it's a fraction tighter, fraction heavier what, um, than what I'm using currently. So the reason why I got a fade on that shot with this 6.5 X-Flex shaft is that basically at the point of impact, the shaft was too tight and kept the face open. So I couldn't release the driver head at the end of So let's hit the stiff shaft and see the results of that. Shaft number two is the hazardous smoke stiff flex shaft, the 6.0. Basically start the ball more straighter to the target and hopefully I get that small little drawback. Club and speed very much the same, spin numbers a little bit lower than before, but it's like club bar very much similar, but now we can see the draw is a fraction back and we can see also the face to path is a negative angle, which means the shaft is squaring a little bit more up compared to the X-Flex. So at the same thing, we can see the club path, pretty natural, pretty good, so very similar to the other shafts, but yes, with the regular flex shaft, we can see the face to, um, face -to path is more closed, Obviously because the shaft's kicking a little bit more at the bottom and we can see obviously the face angle is completely shut. To look at the grouping from carry distance wise, we can see the regular flex shaft, the 5.5, came out left. Left of target, starting left and also closing the face at impact. So if we go, go to the stiff shaft, we can see I actually got a nice little draw going. The grouping is very good, so yet again from my in to out swing path, the face was a fraction closed at impact. And then we can see the 60X shaft right at the top there, staying open. So yet again, at impact, the X-Flex shaft made my face open. I'm gonna work on a mid-tempo swing, and we can see 80 to 90 miles per hour should be roughly in a regular flex. We can see 90 to 100 should be in a stiff flex shaft. And then basically, you know, you can go say close to 110 miles per hour and upwards, you need to be in an X flex shaft. If you have seen this video, you like it, and you think there's something wrong with the current flex shaft of your driver, come and see me here at Golf Concepts, and I'll gladly help you get a better shaft in there that suits your game.